show because it's the Tamar Mikbal show. Bussy, it's been amazing batting. Absolutely amazing. And that is a brilliant shot. But Tammy Moore is absolutely outstanding, no doubt about that. 13 fours. And I'll tell you, anything that came off the blade was sailing away. And some lovely strokes and placement as well. Squeeze it. Absolutely amazing. 20 and some of the sixes were sublime. He doesn't overhit Fuzzy. It was basically the timing and the way he kept the shape of the shots. And you said the feet, he was outstanding, no word of a doubt, I think. That's got to be said. And it's beautiful to watch. It's such a joy. And um, a lot of bag of tricks as well, but you can't describe it any better. Amazing hands, and he knows how to really use all of his body. And look at that for hitting. Oh, that is just magnificent range hitting. And he knows that in the zone. The first one there, Evan Lewis, he actually reviewed this one, and I thought that was pretty well plumb. Yeah, and this is where you've got to ask your, your, the non striker was Tamim at the time, should I go or not? And they were pretty ecstatic to get it. Yeah, that was plum as well. Um, it was um, it looked plum, neck and eye, but unfortunately, he got a bat on it, so he was unlucky on that occasion. I, I saw that post up, and I thought, that is dead. But unfortunately, it wasn't his day. And so Misaka, lack of communication, but what a piece of fielding as well from Shakib. He was nowhere near, not even in the frame. Talk about ball watching. And absolutely spot on. And extraordinary innings of 141 from 61, 24 there from Animal Hark, and then 17 NO from the skipper, and 11 extras to make. Amazing 100 run partnership of 46 balls in Imran Kais scored 17 off 21 of them. Can you believe that? And Tamim scored eight. Bowlers, not so. Just a single wicket for Rubel Hussain and one for Shakib al -Hassan. That's all they could muster. There was a run out and uh, it's just the loss of those three wickets. And uh... The Dhaka Dynamites, yeah, they need 200 in their 20 with the required rate of 10 runs and over. There's some nice batting early on and Ronnie T was uh, quite outstanding with his placement and some of his timing and getting down on one knee often. He used the pace of the bowling well and some good stuff from Mukutaranga. Those two were uh, very useful indeed. Uh, that big partnership there. Pollard uh, struck a couple. He got underway with that Russell, and that was about it from him tonight with the bat. Maximums. Uh, crowd love these, and don't we all? A dozen of these. A little flicks and pickups using the pace of Wahab. Very useful. Yeah, good there, Upal Taranga. And uh, Ronnie Toldega saying, hey, I don't want to miss out either because uh, he got hold of it, smacked four of his own, and Pollard as well got into it. Oh, that was so sweet. Yeah. Umadul got away with a couple. Yeah, nine of them. Hesitation. See you later. Not even in the frame, soon on the Rhine. And then Taranga. Trying to pop one over the fence. Foot on the boundary. And Shakib. Caught by Tamim, the century maker. He was all over the place. It was hard to keep out of the game. Then that little hesitation. Direct. Oh, beautiful. Animal Huck with a direct strike. Russell came and went. Hit a boundary and that was it. And uh, Pollard tried a similar stroke. Caught by that man again. Tamim Milk. I love it. What a celebration. And Shiva got a home. Didn't get going tonight. Out for a duck. Good on the fence. By Pereira. 
And Nura saying Wahab was fizzing at that stage. And then uh, Mamadul caught by Wahab this time. So the chase of exactly 200 proved a little bit too much for the Dakar Dynamites here in the grand final of 2019. Now there is that outstanding uh, partnership of 102 between Taranga and uh, Toldaka. And you thought, well, they were in the contest, they were in the final. Bowling, outstanding. When you look at uh, this uh, bowling card of two for 38 with 10 dots from Saipanin, three for 28 and 14 dots to East.